there you go. That's this side, 90, 98% done. I'm just going to do the same on there, and then we'll be ready for concrete. Right, it's 300 bricks set out. I'm going to get the profiles up now. And we're going to use a mix-up and see what time it takes us to. Monday the 25th, 8 o'clock. Bit late. Usually you get here at 8, that's half 7. But anyway, we're here. Got a lot to do this morning. I've just unwrapped those bricks to try and let the air get to them. You can see how wet they are. So they need honeycombing. We've got concrete to mix for the cavity. I've got a nice board over the hole now, so a bit safer. Got backfilling to do. I've got the vis screen to put in properly. This was just put in temporary to keep the insulation dry over the wet weekend. Fence is coming out. As you can see, the fence is knackered. It's not only leaned out, it's pushed out of the bottom too, so it's coming out, getting replaced. So that's coming out. I think that's coming out. And the two panels, well, three panels, two posts, and the base panels. Uh, we've got um, backfilling to do down there. I think I've said already, but the cavity to concrete, fish screen to get down, backfilling, and then profiles up, load some brick out. Got a full sheet of insulation to spare, so that can go back. We managed to um, muddle around with a few bits. So, um, yeah, we need to honeycomb some bricks today as well. While it's like this, get some wind and sun through them. Then, um, yeah, a lot of fiddly things to do, but we'll, we should be straight by the end of the day and hopefully get a bit of brick work in too. Not sure if the concrete's coming or not today. Um, customer's gone to order it, but I'm not sure if they got it ordered or not. But we'll see. So let's um, let's crack on. Right. Concrete company will come in this afternoon, but they can do this morning. But we need to be ready in an hour because they're on the way. Few miles up the road and then they're coming back here to do this this is 0.6 so we're paying for a meter anyway so we might keep a couple of barrels extra for filling the uh, cavity up and then we're not mixing it then and then the stuff we've got used for mixing we can use for backfilling the uh, bit ballast so priority now is get all this out get our fresh piece in get all the doors cut in get it ready for concrete so um, we'll get back to this lot later once the concrete's in we can do this so oh, yeah, we'll put you to time lapse for this bit. Okay, okay. There you go. That's this side, 90, 98% done. I'm just going to do the same on there, and then we'll be ready for concrete. You got the knife on? Which is due any second. Um, it's here somewhere. Uh, oh, oh. 
I'll go find, I'll try and find this knife. We'll, uh, we'll see you when the concrete's here. Got the big blue chisel out. There you go, that was uh, easier than I thought. So obviously like Dad said, um, now that we can get to it, we'll repoint some of this because it looks uh, less than desirable. That one, that one, that one's obviously being replaced. Look at how flimsy that was. Concrete cancer! Yeah, that's why uh, we can never go wrong with a good timber post. But uh, anyway, 
So that's coming out. I think that panel's coming out so we can get to that corner. And then now we don't have to work overhand. See the little customer does use their gate to get in now. There we go. Glad our break and concrete company have arrived, so I will get you set up somewhere while they get pouring. Morning guys. Morning. Morning. Probably a bit too much in there, but like I said, we're doing the cavities. We've got three barrels over because we're getting our meat, our cubes worth. So yeah, that took what ten minutes. If that. Yeah, so we're all we're all organised now. I'm going to start tamping this. I'm going to put a couple of plastic bags on my feet because I've got no wellies. Are in the back? No, I forgot to bring them, didn't we? Did you? Oh, I'll have a look. So there you go. Get this tamped off. Tamp finish. Uh, I've got a gorilla tub. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, gorilla tub, mate. Just take it out of this, throw it on the pile. Take some out of it, Sevy. Yeah, a little bit left in the August, so they just need to get some. Our, our three barrels are full, so we're going to put it in the, uh, in the gorilla tub. So, yeah. This is um, very. Um, yeah, pressure's off because. There's a screed going on top, so it doesn't have to be perfectly level. It just has to be down deep enough for the screed, and it, it's going to have a tamp finish on it to give it a bit of a key when the uh, screed goes on top. So it's very nice that it's under this pressure trying to get the levels right. And then we've got the uh, probably got about 225mm of concrete to go around the perimeter in the 160 cavs, so it's going to take quite a lot of concrete up that. So we've, we've got plenty. So, uh, yeah. Enough waffling, get me plastic bags on, some of this is coming out and uh, we'll get cracking.
Wind. We're back from lunch, so we've got we've got our board down. We've got this to back fill yet. Nearly finished here. Obviously the slab's done. The cavity's been filled up. There's a good nine inches of concrete in there, and um, we sloped it from the inside to the outside skin. We formed that with the blocks and the bricks, so that we're back filling, but we're leaving the holes out for the fence to the back. We're gonna level that up a bit more. Get all the stuff out the back and then get the profiles up, get a mix in and get a couple of courses on. That's the plan. And the way it is, it's not even worth dragging it out down there. We'll just take the whole thing up, course to course. Because it's just a four brick return each end. Exactly the same. Four brick, four brick, door, door. So, and then, because we took the panels out, you can see we haven't pointed up properly, so we're going to tidy that up tomorrow as well. So, Hopefully we're going to mix used up today at some point. Don't want to look at the time, but I'm going to have to. Half the clock. Ten past one. That's not too bad. So, yeah. A lot of hold-ups again, and we weren't expecting to be doing this and backfilling and stuff. But you just want to keep. You just want to keep pressing on. So you can't just say, "All right, we're going home while you get it backfilled." So um, we we'll could. Well, we could. We're not going to. Can see the reaction? Yeah, sick of going over doing nothing, not getting paid. Yeah. So if it pushes us along, keeps us working, then we'll just get it done. Um probably about another half dozen, maybe eight barrels to go in yet. There's a lot to go up that end. And then um, by that time we'll be set. I might start loading brick out. I think we're gonna take this next panel out as well just for access. So let's crack on. Right, um, I don't like it doing this. It's after two, isn't it? Yeah. Sorry about the wind again. About half two. It's just messing around, setting the mics up in, in the middle of the day. Right, it's 300 bricks set out. I'm going to get the profiles up now. 
and we're going to use a mix-up and see what time it takes us to. So result, so result, backfield. Holes left out for the posts, I think I've already mentioned that. We need an extra spot board and an extra two stands tomorrow, don't we? Yeah, we need to bring all four stands and an extra spot board. And then we're all, we're all set. So I need to get these two profiles up, get them, get, get them nailed up onto the wall, each side. So let's get the boards loaded out and let's get cracking. We need four blocks here for the spot board. Yeah. We'll put one there. Cool, let's go. Damp goes down, one profile up with the fits brick. Do dars on. Go. Through the groove, always forget the groove and then round that. Perfect. Damp course is on, just got the foot last, last tre trestle. Winds up again, just got to get the last profile up. This is up, line up. 2120 divided by 25 gives us 84.8 per course, so just under 85 mil, which is just right because these are 75 mil brick versus 10 mil beds. So just stick to that.
So I'm, you know, I, I think that's a really good point. The fact that you have walked in our shoes, and you're a carpenter and joiner. You've, you've done, really? you've done an apprenticeship, oh. so you're quite.
there we go. If, uh, I don't want to jinx anything, that was our first good day here. <laughs> got the uh, concrete in, got the uh, got fish screen in first, the other throw about that. Fish screen, we concreted it, and then we managed to get five courses. One, two, three, four, yeah, five courses. Six on the um, six on the end. But yeah, happy days. We've actually made some progress. So apparently it's meant to be giving off a load of rain tomorrow, so we're gonna bring tent, much to my dismay. I wanna burn it down because it annoys me. It's cumbersome and heavy. It's all these things that two bricklayers, one of which who's uh, impending his hospital visit shouldn't be messing around with, let alone getting piss wet through while we're you know what, edit this out dad, because I know you're just gonna anyway, anyway, but yeah, so, we should be picking up a tent for tomorrow, get ourselves set up and try and work how we can in the rain, so we will see you tomorrow, and see how that goes. Uh, we were, we were in the middle of a Halloween shoot when dad wanted to get an outro, so I'll let my glamorous uh, assistant. <laughs> Thank you for watching and be sure to like the video. And if you're new to the channel, you want to see more of maybe this, we'll see. <laughs> be sure to hit subscribe and tap on that bell. That way you'll always be notified. It's a great, su great support for the channel and we greatly appreciate it. We're actually close to 40,000 subscribers, so thank you for that support. Any additional support, which isn't necessary, there is the super chat option under the video and there is a link to Dad's PayPal in the description. Again, not necessary, but always highly appreciated, especially in Dad's trying times where his mm. hip's going to get done soon. This has been Bricklaying with Steve, Ghostface, and Nia, and we'll see you in the next one. Try!